Hi, my name is Dan Torkelson. I'm pastor of St. John's Lutheran Church in North Prairie, Wisconsin. I've been a Lutheran Church, Missouri Synod pastor for going on 17 years. I spent four years in my first parish in Iowa District West, uh, where a lot of the ideas behind the presentation I'm going to be doing today uh, got their life. And then I spent 10 years in a little town called Clyman, Wisconsin, in the South Wisconsin District, only about 45 miles from where I currently serve. And that's where a lot of these ideas started to become reality for me, was uh, in my second parish in Clyman. And now I'm starting my fourth year at St. John's Lutheran in North Prairie, uh, where I have the privilege of serving 450 Christians with a preschool and a daycare and a rather vibrant ministry that's going on right now. And it's uh, a privilege to, to bring this topic to you, the topic of pastoring the dying. I'm talking especially about the dying process and terminal illness. When we first come out into the ministry, I think one of the scarier things we get to do, uh, one of the scary firsts that you have as a pastor, is the, the first time you have to pastor someone through the dying process. They get a, a, a diagnosis of a terminal illness and it is our job to, uh, to help guide them safely into the arms of their Lord for eternal life through what can be a kind of a tumultuous last months, several months, days, weeks, of their lives and uh, I've spent a lot of time looking at this subject uh, my my credentials for this come from number one the school of hard knocks I've dealt with a lot of death in my own life and I won't belabor that point that doesn't necessarily make anyone an expert in dealing with uh, the dying in fact it can be a little bit of an impediment depending on your own personal resources as a pastor and how death affects you but uh, as I was Coming up as a, a young pastor, I listened to many stories from other pastors, heard many of the pitfalls and pratfalls along the way that they experienced, and uh, thought through uh, over the course of the years uh, a process for helping people who are dying uh, get into their Lord's arms securely and with a, a sense of uh, comfort and peace, hopefully at the end, through uh, trying to combine the Kubler-Ross model of the five quote-unquote stages of dying. We'll redefine that later and the um, the scriptures just putting the scriptures together with those aspects of dying that Kubler-Ross identified in her famous study uh, on the subject 